Welcome to 527, 89, 529. It's a beautiful day. 79 degrees, partly cloudy. Welcome to Thursday. I already got that exam done today, which was the graded discussion. Not bad at all. I participated more than required, so I expect good merits there. I'm headed back. Pretty much got a study hall. We're watching a movie and taking a senior survey, and then I am friggin' done. That's the Schultz way. Park next to some very nice cars. Oh, red lights. Got to get out and get the camera. That's right. Why not, right? I know this light's long and I just caught it red. So get out, grab the flip out of the trunk. It's 140. School's done. On my way to Jeff's to fix my squeaky window. They got a couple nice cars here at Jeff's. I see a Bentley Continental GT and what I think is a Mondial. Mm. I'm having part of my lunch now. And uh, they got a couple cars here, 335, another 335, an X5, an E63, AMG, a VET, and the two Vectors that have been here forever. They've had these for like a year and a half. Guess they're cool looking. Kind of looks like a Saline S7. It's got Brembo brakes on it. A little different. Then this is nice, but if they made these in a manual, they would be so much better. Because the power is there, the chassis is there. I'm not big on the styling. The brakes are there. The power is there. The transmission's not. And this Vector's 104,000. That one's 94. And they're never going to sell. We're gonna have to stop and get gas uh, on the way home, but uh, we're up to 86 degrees. It's still just beautiful out here. They fixed my window. Um, it wasn't the same as the last problem, which was just a dirty track. There were two little wheels at the bottom that were seized, so they oiled those, and now it's working fine. It was 158, 158 and something, so not too bad. About twenty dollars more than before, and uh, it's worth it to shut that window up. So uh, we're just about at Akron Canton Airport right now, which means we're about. 25 minutes from Hudson and uh, we're making phenomenal time so we'll be back in town soon and we've even got the air conditioning on so you know it's hot when Ryan has the air conditioning on well guys my range is all the way over 19 miles 21 now we're at 22 we were at 18 for a while so I'm gonna stop at Shell I'm just approaching downtown now uh, it's 85 degrees and check it out 162,000 miles can you say plastic? 21 mile range. Yeah, it gets up this hot. We're exactly halfway on the temperature gauge there. Yeah, tad low on that one. 19 miles left. <laughs> it's a good thing the gas station's right there. 19, uh, go get me there. 19's a good number. Uh, I think it's an MG or a Triumph or a Fiat. They all look the same. That one appears to be a Fiat. That's an 18.1 gallon tank. Yeah. Friggin 397.9 a gallon. The worst part about highway driving is all the bugs that get all over the bumper and the windshield and I just cleaned them off. Quarter to 12 in the morning and I just came out here to clean that up because I'm like Jack, I hate driving with the dirty windshield. I have crap all over the place. So some Windex and I found these upstairs so I think I'm just going to use these. These are from the last time we stayed at the Hilton in La Jolla would have been like 03 so get rid of some of those. Um, don't have a whole lot to say. I got my planes trimmed. That was getting a little dickered, so that needed to be done. And uh, that's unplugged. I don't know why. That goes there. Yeah, that's better. So today was just really busy between dinner, which I didn't film, and, and we got the car done, and I filmed some of that. And um, I'm tired. I've got four videos in the Watch Later playlist. I think I'm finally going to kill that tonight. I think this is the past three weeks I've had stuff in there every night. That's the longest I've gone without having that cleaned out. So that'll feel good to get that done tonight. Tomorrow, last day, bittersweet. I'll try to film some of that. I've been cleaning my desk out. This is all stuff that goes upstairs. That goes upstairs. There's recycle. And uh, that's it. So talk to you guys on Friday. Good night.